Today, I am issuing a challenge to you, to myself, and anyone in the community that thinks Tarisman is going to be an easy game. And why not make it a difficult game by doing this easy challenge right here, right now? So let's get into today's video. Hello everyone, yeah, smash like, comment and subscribe for more daily videos, me, Mr. Sneaker, the one and only. And we're here today because I am issuing a challenge to every single one of you, every single one of you that thinks Terrace Land is casual, too easy to play, and you know what, why, why should you play this game? And if it is too easy, why not make an Iron Man mode? And that's what I'm going to do, I'm actually thought of two different iron man modes and it'd be a really fun way of the community potentially streaming live their iron man characters and everyone having a good time right seeing what's going on are they the best iron man mode player in the game and the way you know if someone is an iron man is really easy in this game because there is an achievement for it <laughs> it's an achievement to die once and that is the first requirement for the Iron Man mode. So the Iron Man mode, in order for this to work, is you cannot have this challenge, right? You cannot die. If you die, that is going to have a consequence. And that consequence, to me, if you are doing a true Iron Man mode, is to delete that character. Yes, you heard right, boys. And this is the way some people like playing games. There's games like RuneScape out there that have Iron Man modes. Even World of Warcraft, right, have Iron Man modes. So why not do a community version where we have our Iron Man mode? And I think there's two difficulties that you could do. Um, the soft mode, as we're going to call it, the soft core Iron Man um, challenge will be just to complete taris land do everything you need to do in the game um without dying once right that is including in pvp by the way so if you are choosing to try and push pvp and get up the higher right ladders on pvp that is gonna matter too right so we'll see how brave some players are when it comes to pvp and iron mode um also in the soft mode everything else is just fine it's basically everything anything goes everything and anything goes but if you have this achievement unlocked you lose the iron man mode and you need to go back to your return to character screen and hit the delete button and if you are wondering yes you can delete characters it's a little button. I'm kind of hiding it. It would be behind me. It'd be in my stomach right now. And then you just click, uh, type in delete character. And then you go, right? Now, I think there's a more harder version of playing this game. <laughs> if you want to go true hardcore Iron Man mode, I reckon the next challenge, and maybe some of you guys might be able to think of some creative ways of making it even more harder but I think the next added challenge onto the hardcore mode is that you have to earn everything yourself. So what that means is, yes, you are able to sell stuff onto this auction house. You're able to list it to generate your gold, right? But you're not able to spend that gold in the trade house to buy certain stuff. And some people are going to be like, that's crazy. How are you going to do your professions? Well, that's the point. That is the whole point of an Iron Man mode. It's to do everything yourself, guys. So what it would mean for a player is if they are doing their professions on the Iron Mode challenge, they would have to pick, say, jewelry, right? Do the stuff they want to do for jewelry to get maybe their gems for their gear, but they'll need, as you can see, elementary dye. And elementary dye, linen cloth, and copper are all ingredients that are required from each of the other different areas for the you know profession. So you are going to need to go in there, start using that profession, and work on it to get every single profession basically worked at the same level. And I know a lot of people are going to say it, that's ludicrous. There's not enough vigor in the game. I know. And that's what's the whole point of the Iron Man challenge. It's a longer term game mode that you have to put in your heart, 
your soul, your sweat and tears to complete. And it'll be really fun to see people doing it. I could imagine Spid doing it. If Spid takes the challenge, I might take the challenge. If I take the challenge, maybe some other players take the challenge. Maybe we even get Asmund Gold on here who will take the challenge as an Iron Man account. It'd be really funny to see some players trying to play this game and putting it on the extreme end of things to make it maybe a lot more entertaining than they think it could be, right? There's a lot more risk and basically the glory is the reward of doing so. So let me know what you think about this. Iron Man mode, Taris Line. Do you like the idea? If you do, hit the comment section down below if you are interested in doing so. And maybe, just maybe, we might make a brand new character for this or the EU servers, make it a guild and any Iron Man who wants to participate can join the Iron Man guild. So with that, Stay safe, guys. Stay sneaky. And I'll catch you in the next video. Peace out.